Hello everyone, this is part two of the other masking video where we go into slightly more advanced techniques, but they're really, they're still very beginner. So today I'll just be doing a little backflip with this minifigure. So we just stack up some blocks, so it looks like he is jumping. And then slowly have him go back and turn a bit. I hit the camera, which is like something you don't want to do when doing a masking thing, but I managed to get it back into position. Uh, I use some of the magical clay I'm always using to stick them to the side a bit. I did accidentally put the clay in front of his face a bit, which didn't look good because you could kind of, kind of see the clay, but it still looked fine. So, have them stand up, and then you want to do the masking. So just take a picture of it without anything, like usual. Uh, my app crashed, so I had to reopen it, but I didn't lose anything. You just, like I said, erase around it. It's like it was, this time it looked pretty good because I used a pretty dark background because on the other one, the light kept reflecting off it and it didn't look very good. But yeah, here's the clay that kind of, you could see a little bit. And in one of the frames, I made him turn way more than he did in any of the other ones, but I still think it looked pretty good. So this, delete all the frames, this is the final result. Um, there is, a, there was still a little light flicker, that was mainly because you want to kind of keep your, the room that you're doing it in a little dark, so just promptly just throw a frog and toad at the window, so it'll make it dark. Okay, that was off topic, but now I'll just be doing one where this guy throws a spear at the clone. So, magical clay, just put it on the edge. Turn it a bit, and then just oh, I messed something up here. Okay, now just put the clay down. And uh, a thing that you can use is just red clay. It, it helps stick to him and it also kind of looks like blood so it doesn't look terrible and you don't have to mask it out usually. It's kind of struggling there. So then empty picture. Let's start masking. This one was off a little bit, you see where it, it's kind of like there's an unequal distance between the studs. So that's just because I didn't keep the camera still the entire time, which is usually what you should do. But that one, there's only two frames of it actually needing to be masked, so it was pretty fast. I tried to get rid of the uh, clay on the hand, but if I was a little bit better and had like extra frames of him standing I probably could have but it doesn't look terrible so uh for oh yeah lighting uh, I accidentally had it on you have to put it on uh, manual and like just get like the shutter and all that good because that can mess up the lighting and make it not look great so that is the end of this short, well, not really short, tutorial. Hope you enjoyed. Like, subscribe, comment, all that gross stuff. Okay, bye.